Okay. Hmm. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going, to be honest. I need to find someone who can help me. Are you important? Yeah, see, he's not going to help me because I'm not actually part of the clan yet. Hmm. And all these doors are trapped and stuff. Can I rest here? Yes, I can. Hopefully my magicka will still restore. Yes. I get another dream. I think I get dreams like every time now. Uh, so where's mysticism? Because I really should be quite... No, not mysticism. Telekinesis. 100% chance to cast this. Oh, you look you look important. You got a robe on. Nope. Alright. Nope. Now they still might not appreciate me taking everything that I see. But I am very aware that uh Oh you're joking, I got seventy seventy seven percent chance of casting that. Uh, oh, nice. Um, what was I saying? Completely forgotten. I think I was saying that I'm completely unprepared to be a vampire. No matter. We'll just rest. Awkward. Look, rest until healed. Because uh, I don't have all the spells and stuff I might want to use. Like destruction spells would be very useful because... Uh... Oh. Goodbye. You're a vampire as well, you know. You're a very confused individual. Whoever you are. Right, there's somewhere I haven't been, obviously. Hmm. But I think that uh, quite a lot of you will be suggesting that I cure the vampirism because I know that that's a quest and a half. Again, it's something that I've never done. Right. I'm running out of places to go here and that map is useless. I like how you can ask about that, but nothing else. Maybe if I bribe someone will talk to me like a little bit more waste a bit of gold on her what do you want new blood uh, I want to uh, do things man uh, I might just exit out of the game and um, you know to save you watching me wander around the same places over and over again in some you know random manner because I'm not really doing it very systematically um, I would hate to think that the guy I had to talk to was the guy I've killed. Uh, that would suck. I mean, I, I'm like, um, I am a member of this clan because I've got all the bonuses for it. Right, you're someone new. No, you're not. What if I bribe you? You will take my money. You just didn't that time. Right now, will you? Nope. All right, I'm just gonna uh, exit out of the game for a second and see what I should be doing here because I have forgotten. I will see you soon. Okay, we're back. Yes, I'm in the right place, but um, I'm supposed to talk to someone who I haven't found yet. I might try looking down there. I 
her last name is Ayunde, which uh, makes sense because this is Clan Clan Ayunde. Yep, I think that's her. I don't know where that leads, but hello. You're definitely who I need to speak to, aren't you? Yes, you are. Okay. What is it, little monster? I'm not a little monster. How does an abomination such as you plan to serve me? You, an unfortunate accident perpet perpetrated by one of my kind. Hmm, you are expendable enough, so maybe of use to me. I have some questions about my past I need answered, and you may may be fit to get get this information. Answers about my family. Yes, flesh, fresh blood. Uh, I once had a family. We were highborn, even among the Altma, and lived with my husband and young son until my rebirth. My sire killed my former husband, but my son, Vilandon, was allowed to live. I am curious what became of the boy, although he has likely gone the way of mortals now. Still, it would be amusing to know his fate. I will find out about your child. Uh, I'm not sure whether I have time to do this quest, uh, with all the um, messing about I've done, but I'll give it a go. Good, if you bring me back useful information, I will allow you to use the clan services here at Ashmelech, if it suits me too. Uh, the last I heard of any about his former family, they occupied a region that is now Sadrith Mora. Uh, where's Sadrith Mora? It's just here, isn't it? Uh, you may wish to start there. Take this ring, there's my family crest. Any high elf in the region should recognise it, and may be able to give information to me. Go. Right. Okay, so I have to go to Sadrith Mora. That's in House Tele that's House Televani. Alright, that means that I'm gonna have to walk there, so I'm not going to do that because Sadrith Mora is there. I'm here. I can't use fast travel. So if I use No, I won't no. I haven't really um to be honest, I haven't really like Planned this uh, enough, like to become a vampire. Um, if I, if I'm, look how fast I move though. If you're a vampire in Morrowind and you plan for it, you've got, to, you've got to make sure you've got all of your spells and all of the stuff that you need uh, before you do it. And I didn't really have a chance to do that. Excuses, excuses. Um, so I don't know, like I don't know what what you guys want to do. Um, whether you want me to continue with this. With this game, or whether I should, um, like I've I've done the mission, um, I've done the mission, but all right, so I'm back where I should have been in the first place. Okay, but yeah, it's it's I'm not sure whether it's it's um, suitable to keep it in the LP because I can't talk to anyone and I can't fast travel. So, so I don't know whether you want to keep it or not. I don't I don't know. Like um, leave it in your in your suggestions. Maybe just like let me know what you think, and I'll I'll sort of use my common sense. And um, yeah, just leave a comment about how you think I should continue the LP because now that I'm a vampire, it really changes the way you play the game. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop stop now because uh, I've completed it. I've I've joined a clan more or less, and I've become a vampire. I'm a very very vam very uh, powerful being a vampire, but you know the downsides may outweigh the upsides for an LP such as this. So um, I don't know. We'll see. Let me know what you think. Um, I guess that'll do for uh, this session so thanks very very much for watching this episode of Let's Interactively Let's Play Morrowind and I shall see you next time whatever may happen so uh, toodaloo